Hey guys, happy Friday. I am here today to give you a little bit of an ab workout. Okay, this is just one of my um, sequences that we do sometimes um, throughout the week. Add a couple um, exercises together and this should be nice and easy for you guys to follow. Adjust this a little bit here. You can see what we're doing. Okay. I just start by warming up my abs with a little bit of a crunch. You can do an open butterfly, keep your tummy tucked, or just a regular feet flat on the ground here and come up. I like to come here so I don't build my, my tummy out. And just up. You're not pulling on your neck, just nice and easy. Okay, we're gonna bring our legs up. It's just a little 90 degree or so. And just the same thing. You can also go straight up in the air if you like. Same thing, just adjust. Keep your back flat, belly button push straight to the ground and up. Nice and neutral again in the neck and the arms. And you can do 10, 12, 15 of each one of these. I like to do a cross crunch here. There's several ways you can do it. You can come up and the key here is just, you're trying to bring your opposite elbow to opposite knee. So you can stay flat again, tucked in and up and try and pull. If you don't like that version, I like to use a little more oblique. So I like to cross and out. And you can come out or down, whichever you prefer. And switch. Okay, we're going to go for another one here. I like these guys tuck your hands under your butt again pushing straight down so you're supporting that core in your back and we're gonna do in and out here try and pull your butt and your knees up towards your chest And your feet are coming back at about six inches or so above the ground here after you crunch and extend. Okay, and then you're gonna go straight into a leg lift. Up. Try and hold your core tight into the ground. And you're controlling on the way up and on the way down. Okay. You're gonna cross over now, lay onto your hip and your side. And this is a great crunch here for your oblique. You can do two ways, up, crunch, or you can bring your leg up and out and crunch. You're not pulling with your neck. You're just lifting straight up and crunching in here. Sorry for the backside, you guys. Anything? Yep.
this guy I like to press to the ceiling. So again, I like to support my lower back with my hands underneath. We'll come in and push up. So out, up. You can hold with the plank. Try and tuck your butt. Hold your core tight. Forearms to the ground and look straight ahead. If you feel your lower back starting to get weak or drop, your butt dropping, you can relax yourself or you can pull in to a spider and crawl takes the pressure off your back just long enough and then you can reset into a plank. And one last for me. I'm going to do a crunch, bringing the legs up and at the top. Bring it all together. Don't pull on the neck. Up. Try to remember your tempo. As you get tired, you start to go a little bit quicker sometimes. We're at the end of the exercise in the gym and you're ready to go home. one of my sequences so you'll do four rounds of those put them all together um, you can stop take a break in between um, get a drink of water and then go right back into it so these are not going to have the pause in between you'll just go from one exercise to the next it's a good solid workout solid core um, you will feel your, feel your heart rate go up a little bit during that and you do definitely get warm a nice tummy nice tight tummy um, one of my other favorites, and I don't have the stick out here for it, but if you were standing straight, you can take a PVC pipe or a broom or whatever. And I just love, I don't like adding weights when I'm doing anything on my sides, especially in my obliques. So you can have your PVC pipe straight behind your, behind your neck like a broom and just tip. The other thing I like to do with that is a twist. So you're just going to rotate. Gives you a nice little movement in here, little angles and a cut, but it helps with your, definitely with your rotation and lubricating those joints as well. Happy Friday. Hope you guys have a fantastic weekend. Enjoy.